full speed in the lane, still getting it. <laughs> Hey guys, what's going on? It's Sam here, and I'm back with some more Minecraft. But it's a Minecraft mod tutorial today, and it's on the Aether mod. And I'm specifically doing this on the Aether because I'm going to be doing a Let's Play on the Aether as well. Well, not as well. I'm doing a Let's Play on the Aether, and Dan's here. Hello, guys. And Dan, what are you going to be uploading soon? Single player. He's going to be starting a new single player, which is good. And uh, so, yeah, let's get into it. You need four programs slash folders one is the eighth mod is the eighth mod itself which is here second one you're going to need mod loader which is this one oh. no it pops up every time look next one is audio mod last one is shock api r5 and all these links will be in the description of the video no, oh, I'm going to, obviously. Okay, so first of all, go into search bar. You can either type run and then straight away OK, or you can type in app percentage app data percentage. And I know, I did it on purpose. And then click on your dot Minecraft. First of all, you want to go into the actual Minecraft itself. And another good thing is, is to create a folder on your desktop. Whoops. Create. Oh, where is it? There it is. Create a new folder called Backup. Backup saves, and then drag all of your saves in there, which is by going into here, saves, and just drag them all into there. But I don't care about them well, so I don't mind if I lose it, but I doubt I will. So go Options, Force Update, Done, and then Log in again. If that if 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 that doesn't work, if you don't if you don't want to do that, you can just go into App Data and uh, just delete the whole dot Minecraft. So once yeah, no. So once that's done, no, it's automatically reinstalled now. You go back into App Data Percentage App Data Percentage dot Minecraft. You go to Bin. Right click on Minecraft. For this, you're gonna need WinRAR Archiver, as I've said in the other video. Right click from Open with Wimmer Archiver. This is essential. You need to delete the meta inf meta inf folder. Delete. Yes. And you're going to have to keep this folder up here. Or oh, you're going to need this bit here. So if you just minimize that. Okay, so let's get. Oh. Let's get straight into it. Another thing I'm going to do is. Ah. Uh. uh is get too many items because I'm going to be using that just to mess around with it before I start the tutorial All right so I'm going to first of all just grab all my too many items class files drag it in and there you go too many items is done okay so now back onto the actual Aether mod so double click on mod loader get all these class files you don't need the top you don't need the top file folder just what the hell don't worry. Then that one. So there's your mod loader out of the way. You can move that way. Let's go onto audio mod now. Just click these bot. Oh, it's really annoying. These bottom three files. Okay. And that's audio mod out of the way. Now shock API. You get the bottom. Oh, wait, no, you don't. You go into bin. I nearly got that wrong. Yeah, it's probably a good idea just to do Control A. Actually, I'll just do that. Control A will drag all the class files in. And that is Shock API out of the way. And now the eighth mod, this is quite. Well, you need to do this correctly. So go on to Jar. And this time do Control. Ugh, why does it do that? What? I don't know, it just doesn't let me do Control A. Did you do the second folder in Shock API? You don't, you don't need to. Then OK, and now you go back here to where resources is. That's when your this bit comes in handy. Just drag the whole resource files where the bin, config, mods, resource, and all that is. Click yes, yes, skip, yes, 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 yes. yes. Why doesn't this, this doesn't need room for air well? Skip. 
Where say that? I don't see why it's not letting me. Oh. Right, yeah, so that's it. Wait, which one did you... Was it Shock API you said I didn't do? That one? Yeah. I know, you don't need that one. So that is you done. I might install single player commands. Do I need that? No. But then, so that's... Everything completely out of the way. Now, open up your Minecraft. Mini crafty. Open up a world and look, I'm already in the Aether. But if I. Oh no, no, I don't want to show you this one. That's the one I'm going to be starting because I just don't want to go through all the quick shiz. And. Woo! So here I am in the normal Minecraft world. And this is how you, I'm going to show you first of all how to make the actual Aether. What do you call this? A portal. Yeah, portal. A portal. So what you're gonna need, you're gonna need I think it's forty in glowstone dust. No, glowstone. And go one, two, three, three, four, and then go one, two, three, four. One two Wee Oh a tree my friend. And there's that bit, and then you go and find your 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 self. Uh, I need some water. And right click. Woo! So it's not flint and stone like a normal portal. Nope, it's water. And then you go into a portal. I'm gonna go into this one because I know that that puts me where I was. Hopefully, please don't be gay. Oh yeah, I made a thing here. Ah, uh, run! For the demons, get me! But oh well, so that is how to install. Oh yeah, I actually spawned in a dungeon, no lie, no lie. So that's how to get the Aether mod and to use it. There'll be an Aether, Aether Let's Play! Aether Let's Play very soon, possibly even today. And this will be uploaded on the 13th, most likely. So if you like the video, please like and subscribe and favourite if you're feeling nice person. Nice person. Yes, like me and Dan. Nice. Aren't we, Daniel? Yes, yes, yes. So thanks for watching. See you guys later.